पार्लियामेंट पार्लियामेंट्री फॉर्म ऑफ गवर्नमेंट पार्लियामेंट्री सुप्रीमेसी एंड पार्लियामेंट्री सोवरेंट्री इन दिस इंसाइटफुल लेक्चर वी ट्राई टू ब्रिंग इन एक्सपर्ट एनालिसिस एंड इन डेप्थ एंड कॉम्प्रीहेंसिव अंडरस्टैंडिंग अबाउट अबाउ मैन सन्ड कॉन्सेप्ट फर्स्ट पार्लियामेंट इन आर कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन आर कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन कॉनर स्टोन ऑफ ए नेशन द ट्रांसफॉर्मेटिव कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ए लिविंग डॉक्यूमेंट डॉक्यूमेंट ऑफ सोशल रिवोल्यूशन और कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन पार्ट फाइव चैप्टर सेकेंड पार्लियामेंट आर्टिकल सेवेंटी नाइन डील्स विथ Constitution of Parliament. Parliament shall consist of President and two houses, to be known respectively as the Council of States, Rajya Sabha, and the House of People, Lok Sabha. In essence, Parliament consists President. राज्य सभा एंड लोकसभा पार्लियामेंट्री सुप्रीमेसी मीन्स सुप्रीमेसी ऑफ पार्लियामेंट इनेक्टेड लॉज और स्टिट्यूटरी लॉज एग्जाम्पल यूनाइटेड किंगडम वाई पार्लियामेंट्री सुप्रीमेसी एग्जिस्ट एज कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन is the fundamental and supreme law means all other laws are based on it and any law that contradicts it or inconsistent with it shall be null and void but in united kingdom where there is no written constitution so supremacy of statutory laws and the lack of judicial review is a natural consequence parliamentary sovereignty india is the example of parliamentary sovereignty not parliamentary supremacy parliamentary sovereignty meaning parliament is the supreme law making authority or institution its second dimension sovereignty lies in we the people of india and parliament as a institution as a authority represents reflects radiates our will or sovereign people's will the constitutional role of our parliament is to deliberate and enact laws that will guide determine the destiny of our greatness our great nation now the question arises what makes our nation a great nation in the national movement transformed the continuous civilization with great cultural heritage into a nation or into a modern nation with constitutional morality that makes it great unique or a democratic wonder healthy functioning of parliament is the bedrock of rule of law rule of law means limited government as it checks authoritarianism of government or state limiting state's authority with various constitutional methods or ways rule of law built on 
supremacy of law, not an individual or their wishes, whims. Its second dimension, equality before law, not privileges for few, and equal protection of law. Rule of law constitutes constitutionalism and constitutionalism is the primary edifice on which Indian democracy stands. Every member of parliament has to take oath or affirmation under third schedule of our constitution which require them to bear true faith and allegiance to the constitution of India. The greatness of an institution like Indian parliament determined by manner in which our representatives discharge their constitutional obligations or address people them they represent their aspirations, their dreams, their expectations. As democracy expects democratic way of life that built on certain norms, standards that may not be written but expected to be inculcated in character and reflected in parliament's functioning path of di dialogue, discourse, dissent and decision making leads towards vibrancy or resonance of democracy. Our founding guardians adopted and nurtured parliamentary form of government while resisting exploitative, racial, divisive, communal, oppressive, colonial regime. Under India's freedom struggle that led a whole wave of anti-colonial struggle. Parliamentary form of government's uniqueness lies in coordination and cooperation between legislature and executive's powers or coordination among the organ of governance. In this form of government, members of executive compulsorily will be members of legislature. Dual executive one constitutional or symbolic example president as head of state. Second real or substantive head of council of ministers prime minister as a head of government. In a presidential form of government, sorry, in parliamentarian form of government, president as a symbolic constitutional head of state, whereas council of ministers head PM as head of government, legislature. Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha, Executive, Constitutional Head and Real Head. Parliamentary, and parliamentary form of government synthesized a new institution, Parliament, or created a new institution, Parliament, integrating legislature and executive in essence where parliament consists 
प्रेसिडेंट लोकसभा एंड राज्यसभा वेयर एज पार्लियामेंटेरियन और पार्लियामेंट्री फॉर्म ऑफ गवर्नमेंट कंसिस्ट प्रेसिडेंट प्राइम मिनिस्टर प्राइम मिनिस्टर एज ए हेड ऑफ काउंसिल ऑफ मिनिस्टर लेजिस्लेचर वेयर काउंसिल ऑफ स्टेट्स राज्यसभा एंड हाउस ऑफ पीपल लोकसभा and along with also executive that's constitutional head and a real head of executive executive shall be responsible collectively to parliament in general and the lok sabha in particular presidential form of government the distinct with separation of power where president as single head of state and also government or executive example united states of america although presidential form of government brings about expertise and excellence in administrative skills or decision making of executive whereas parliamentary form of government lacks in comparative analysis some extent presidential stability administrative expertise and excellence but not erect with deadlock between legislature and executive as presidential form of government example united states of america's deadlock on debt ceiling bill between senate and president head of executive parliamentary form of government also known as cabinet government where power lies in council of ministers or cabinet not in an individual's hand that radiates true spirit of democracy and day to day responsibility and accountability to sovereign people reflects true democratic spirit indian parliaments law making in direction of anti defection law aimed at bring stability in parliamentarian or parliamentary form of government along with its inspiring beauties beauties initiatives towards later entry will add momentum or brings in expertise and excellence in terms of administrative and executive skills and decision making